Good morning, parents and students of Level 6. This is an overview of the Level 6 curriculum. We start out with Session 1, which focuses on care of creation. We'll review that God created everything and all humans are created in God's image. We'll become familiar with the seven themes of Catholic social teaching. We'll understand that taking care of God's creation is a Catholic social teaching. We'll explain that Pope Francis's encyclical on the environment is Laudato Si on care for our common home. We'll introduce students to this encyclical and the theme of this letter will be running throughout the curriculum of level six. The letter addresses the idea of taking care of our planet. We'll appreciate the intricate systems that God designed in nature with a fun craft. Session two focuses on the communion of saints. I'm talking about how the communion of saints is a community like a family. It's made up of all of us on earth and all those who have lived before us who are now with God. We'll talk about how this community is made up of many people who've lived out the Catholic social teaching of care for creation. We'll focus on St. Francis and how he praised God our creator with his canticle of the sun, a prayer that has been turned into a song. Session three focuses on Jesus' love for creation, that Jesus calls us to love all of creation, and he's a model of mercy and healing. How Jesus shows the importance of sharing the goods of the earth, and that we are called to be stewards of creation and to not be wasteful. Session four focuses on care of creation during Advent, that Advent is a perfect time for Catholics to live out our vocation to be protectors of God's handiwork and that all creation shows the greatness of God. Session five focuses on justice and peace. How we relate to other human beings reflects our communion with the rest of nature. Peaceful communication with others shows our respect for human dignity and to practice making good moral decisions. Um, there'll be suggested role plays of different moral dilemmas. This will be adapted for the virtual classroom. Session six focuses on a new way of being. Way of being rather than a way of doing allows us to quiet ourselves to such a degree that allows us to listen to God. We'll discuss making a space to allow for time for being in God's presence in prayer. We'll become familiar with the practice of adoration of the Eucharist and we'll contemplate the mystery of the Eucharist. Session seven focuses on the Trinity and how the Trinity teaches harmony. The Trinity means that the nature of God is a community of three divine persons, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. The Trinity is a model for living in harmony, and we'll look at the mystery of the Trinity, how it helps us care for our common home because it models for us the interconnectedness that we experience with nature and humanity. We'll also be in that lesson learning to communicate better, which enables us to understand one another and live harmoniously. Session eight focuses on mercy. We'll understand that showing mercy means acting in a way that demonstrates compassion and forgiveness. We'll explore the meaning of mercy within the Bible and think about how we can connect the concept of mercy to how we treat our common home. Session nine talks about the care of creation during Lent. That Lent is a time for prayer, fasting, and almsgiving. Explore ways to connect prayer, fasting, and almsgiving to care for creation. We'll talk about Ash Wednesday, and that Lent is a time, beginning with Ash Wednesday, to reflect on our spiritual habits and reorient ourselves towards God. Session 10 talks all about the Blessed Mother, Mary, as a model for care of creation. Students can identify areas in their lives where they contribute to the throwaway culture idea. And students will understand where products come from and where they go when they're disposed of. And students will understand that we're called by God to be stewards of the earth and that we pray to Mary to help us look at the world with wisdom so that we can understand how to care for God's creation.